arterial blood gas sampling of the radial artery is a commonly undertaken clinical procedure, particularly in the assessment and monitoring of a significantly unwell patient. Before carrying out the puncture of the radial artery, it's important that we assess that the patient has an adequate collateral circulation to the hand via the ulnar artery in case of complications to the radial artery supply. To assess this, we need to perform the modified Allen's test. This involves applying pressure at the site of the radial artery as well as the location where the ulnar artery should be present. The patient then makes a tight fist, which squeezes the majority of the arterial blood out of the hand. We then release the pressure that has been placed over the ulnar artery. And if there is an adequate collateral supply via the ulnar artery, then the hand should be reperfused almost instantly. So in this case, we know that our patient has a good ulnar artery supply. Therefore, during obtaining the ABG sample, if the radial artery were to become thrombosed and blocked, we know that this collateral supply would prevent any ischemia of the hand from occurring, which is obviously really important. If having released pressure on the ulnar artery, the hand flushes in less than six seconds, as we can see is the case here, this indicates an adequate ulnar artery collateral supply and is a positive modified Allen's test, and therefore we'd be safe in proceeding to perform the radial artery puncture. If reperfusion of the hand takes longer than this, in particular longer than 10 to 15 seconds, this indicates a negative modified Allen's test and suggests an inadequate ulnar artery supply, and therefore puncture of the radial artery should be avoided at all costs. If you enjoyed watching this video, then make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel for more great free content. Or if you want to make sure you know what you need to know for med school, then subscribe to surgicalteaching.com for more great videos, learning forums, and MCQs.